February can be one of the worst months for the law because it's had all the winter weather, it's often been very wet and cold. And at this time of the year, when you look at a lawn, instead of it being lovely and green, it's often quite pale and doesn't look in tip-top condition. And one of the problems this year, because it's been a mild, wet winter, is there's lots of moss in the lawn. And this is just growing like mad in these lovely, mild, wet conditions. And although February isn't the main month for doing any work on the lawn, there's a few things you can do now that will really help to get it in tip-top condition this year, which will help it stand the dry weather, should we get another drought. So what I'm going to do before I do anything is either using a, a stiff brush or this is a bees and broom made from some birch branches or even a garden rake is just to, to give it a light brush first. That moves off any twigs, any leaves, it disperses the dew and it just makes it easier for working on the lawn. It also gets lots of air around the base of the grass and that's good and it stimulates growth. So you need to sweep the entire lawn. Once you've done that, then another job you can do uh, is to spike the surface. And all I'm going to do is to prick the top a couple of inches of the soil. And what that will do, again, it will get air to the roots, which will start to stimulate growth when the warm weather comes. But it also just helps with surface drainage. And if your lawn's fairly soft, as this one is, there's no effort really involved. It's just a case of working your way all over the lawn and to do a lawn of this size would perhaps take 15-20 minutes so it's good exercise do it little and often and that will do a power of good to the lawn and then when you've done the whole lawn with the fork i'm going to give it a dressing of a product called lawn sand and this is basically washed silver sand with iron sulfate in it won't feed the grass but what it will do is have a greener effect. So instead of looking pale and yellow, it will start to look green without growing nice and lush. But at the same time, the sulfate of iron will kill the moss. So within about 10 days to two weeks of putting this on, the lawn will go black and I can then start to rake it out. So you can put it on by hand or you can use a spreader like this. And it's simply a case, walk across the lawn and apply it nice and evenly.